What's up, Gemini darlings? I'm Laurel, and welcome to Laurel's Moon, this bitch. Join me as I read you your life, baby. Thank you to everyone who has liked, shared, commented, subscribed to my channel. You already know I appreciate each and every single one of you motherfuckers. Yes, I do, baby. And if you need to get a personal reading from me, make sure that you hit that description box down below. Check out my website, laurelsmoon.com, for any other magical purposes and deviation workings and things of that nature. So, spirit, you are welcome into this reading. You must sage the cards for my Gemini air gods, baby. Let's see what's going down for this four-month prediction uh, for January all the way until um, April. I already had a pre-shuffle. I have pulled four cards. So let's see what's going down. Smoke with me, baby. Relax with me, baby. Do what you got to do. Let's figure out what's going down so we can prepare ourselves, all right? So uh, for the month of January, I have strengthening bonds, okay? So there could be a relationship or a situation that's coming together a little bit more closer. Some of you all could want a closeness in coming together with strengthening your bonds with someone that you love, okay? Someone that you could have had some past issues with and now you're trying to make a reconnection is what i'm getting here gemini so for the month of february we have love abound so there's some love coming in for the month of february a big ass fucking heart all right something that you've been keeping your eye on or something that's in your heart's desires okay now for the fourth month i'm getting believe and succeed here So it could be a successful business venture, okay? Things that you need to believe in that's going to work, that's going to work for you is here, okay? For the month of April, I'm getting seek the truth. Could be some things that you're going to be seeing that's uh, eye-opening to you, okay? So let's see what's going down. I'm going to get the rebel messages for all of the months for my Gemini's. For the month of January 2020. That's too many. For the month of January 2020 for my Gemini's. Damn. Okay, love. Talk to me, baby. For February 2020, give me a card for Gemini. Fucking apologize. Okay. Believe and succeed for the month of March 2020 for Gemini. Ask a fucking expert. Four. The month of April. Seeking the truth for Gemini. That project, that person, that idea is waiting. Okay. So for the month of January, I'm seeing here there's some love that you're strengthening in your bonds. You could be finding love, discovering love, especially moving into February, okay? I'm getting for some of you guys, someone needed an apology or they need to keep apologizing to you coming into February or someone's needing to make that shit up, all right? At the bottom of the deck was joy and stability, Okay, so I do feel like coming into 2020, a lot of you guys want that joy and stability. So let's see what's going on to my Geminis. Let's shuffle these cards. All right, so far we have the lovers, the two of swords. And the nine of pentacles, all right? So I feel like there was something that you were waiting, a partnership um, something coming into February. I'm getting for some of you guys. You're happy in your independence, but you're still kind of indecisive about what you want when it comes down to dualities and partnerships. Okay. I'm seeing that for some of you guys with this nine of pentacles, you're wanting this, um, you're wanting time to reflect on yourself. You're also wanting your happiness, your essence. Okay. Some of y'all could be taking pictures. There could be a lot of photos. You could be getting a lot of attention with this Nine of Pentacles, but I'm seeing with 
the two of pentacle or the two of swords that you're still kind of indecisive about a relationship okay like i said this could be a gemini libra aquarius also virgo taurus capricorn so far i'm getting for um the month of february it's kind of like you feel a little flatlined towards your situation but you're also still coming out of the cold just trying to get up the hill just trying to reach you know for that new beginning i feel like you've grabbed all that you could whether it be knowledge whether it been relationship um understanding i'm getting with the five of pentacles and also with the seven of pentacles you're you're really trying to reach those goals okay now um for some of you all you could be dealing with a aquarius as well i did just see the star energy all right so for the month of february i see the six of cups as well so someone from your past is definitely here to stay they might be in some sort of struggles okay or you might be in some sort of struggles but you're coming out of that with this five of cups in reverse all right you're no longer just sitting around and waiting the cups and looking at them like they're empty you're ready to get out and go all right um i do feel like there's some sort of partnership being built here also could be a lot of sexual energy that's coming in okay some sort of intercourse <laughs> yeah gemini yes baby yes or building partnerships friendships look how they're building something here okay it looks like a statue it looks like something monumental something that they want to build that's stable all right but i'm also getting with the uh ace of pentacles um and the moon card there could be a lot of things that come out about the truth you could be dealing with a pisces all right but I do feel uh, with the Princess of Cups, there's a lot of emotions, a lot of secrets that are coming out for the month of February. You could be dealing with a Scorpio. But I'm seeing you guys progress into, um, <clears throat> it looks to me like there's a renewal or somebody that's going through or some sort of um, new beginning, okay? Or wanting to start over. Somebody coming back from the dead, baby, all right? <laughs> Somebody's wanting to come and apologize. That's what this fucking apology is all about. Okay, that's what I'm seeing here. I do feel like with the Queen of Pentacles, you guys are going to be on your money. Ten of Pentacles as well, Gemini. So a lot of stability coming in. Some of y'all got money surrounding you. Some of y'all, you know, you don't even have to show what's in your accounts to know that you got it going on uh, with the Ten of Pentacles. But I do feel like there could be somebody who's wanting to either move in with you or somebody who's wanting to take a break. Um, but I'm also getting here with the Ten of Cups, the Eight of Pentacles. There's someone who's uh, thinking and researching about a love or a situation that brings in a lot of new love here. Okay, but I'm getting for some of you guys, um, there's some sort of communication or somebody's coming in pretty swiftly with the Eight of Wands, Ten of Cups. Looks to me like there could be something that just happens within a flash or there could be a message of some sort, all right? So just be aware of that, that somebody's coming in, kicking like Bruce Lee up in this motherfucker, Bruce Lee Roy and shit. Somebody that definitely wants uh, possession of you or they definitely feel like they're, they need to hold on to you with this Four of Pentacles, all right? I'm also getting with this Prince of Cups and the Magician energy that this person could be a little manipulator. Um, I feel like, you know, this person always has something up their sleeve. They might just look like that person, okay? Might have his chin like that and everything. Um, his chin, hairs, and everything, okay? But I do feel like somebody wants to... Um, they want stability with you, but at the same time, they're unstable. All right? You got the hair of font and the hangman. So somebody could be hanging around... Or this person could be teeter-tottering on if they want a relationship or not. All right? But definitely something that's coming in that somebody wants some sort of relationship here, okay? So for March, it's saying ask an expert. Some of y'all could be on your financial side, okay? Really taking care of your business with that belief and succeed and ask a fucking expert. You guys could be at the top of your mastery is what I'm seeing here. Now also... Um, for some of you Geminis, I'm seeing that there's some sort of cycle that's, um, I feel like you've had to let your guard down because of a third party situation. It's kind of moving from some old energy or residual energy into a progressive new beginning here, okay? Some of y'all could be wanting to um, travel or there could be some traveling that's involved with this world energy. Um, but I am getting 
there there's something here let's see emperor will of fortune there's some sort of change happening okay in march there's a destined change you guys are on top of your business if you own your own business you're gonna have money out the ass okay with this will of fortune some of you guys have already um you guys are that emperor okay you own your shit and nobody can tell you shit i feel like for a lot of you guys there could be um some things that you're working towards and your goals uh financially here that are going to come into fruition the nine of cups will of fortune emperor energy i'm also getting aries okay um but definitely somebody who's in their wish fulfillment all right uh, someone, someone might try to control some things here, but I feel like things are really well balanced with the six of pentacles, all right, on top of your game, being on top of your game, balancing your finances, six of wands, yeah, somebody's going to either go viral or there could be something that <clears throat> you start up and it's like, you know, your, um, if you're in a startup business or if you're starting a business, there's definitely some somebody is watching you. You guys are on the spotlight. Okay, hey, you're going to be making your money. So definitely be aware of that. A lot of success happening for the month of March. All right. <clears throat> and I feel like that's kind of running into April with that idea, that project, that person. The world has your back. So you guys could be center stage. Ace of Pentacles here. Wow, Gemini. And the Fool. So there could be some money all of a sudden. Like I said, some of y'all might be going viral. All right, there might be um, <clears throat> a new opportunity. There could be some jobs and offers uh, that could be coming your way, following on, along in a new journey. And I'm seeing here with the Two of Pentacles, um, you could have been entertaining some things, um, but I do feel like you're going to be concentrating on just your main goals. Uh, you know, not being narrow-minded, but just concentrating on your coin all right somebody might be doing t-shirts or there might be some sort of illustrations or some things like that that you might be doing as well too um some graphic design those types of things but just watch out for the snakes because i did see this snake here now we do have the tower energy and also the king of cups so somebody might be having some sort of explosive behavior but you already know you know this could be something that might come up with the seven of swords in reverse or something that somebody could be um, telling you about in their behaviors. Or something that you definitely need to be on the lookout for. But you got justice on your side anyway, Gemini. So if you've done the right thing and you know that karma is, um, you know, awaiting. I feel like for some of you guys, you really do know that the world has your back, right? People have your back. Now, I am getting, for some of you guys, with this um, this uh, Ten of Swords, there might be someone who feels like they uh, have been backstabbed coming towards, um, coming to us or towards April, okay? Or there could be somebody who's being backstabbed. This could be you, Gemini, who's backstabbing them, okay? But I'm getting with this Empress energy and also, um, for some of you guys, this Nine of Swords, somebody feels like they might be pushed away or... You know, I feel like there could be somebody who's um, definitely trying to let go of a third party situation. But you guys could be dealing with a player like energy. So, so be aware of that coming towards April. Okay, damn, we got the king of wands flying out. All right, yeah. So be aware of somebody betraying you or somebody who's just tired of dealing with the same old, same old. Okay, let's see what's going on with Romance Angels for the month of January. We have express your love. Go ahead and make that romantic gesture. All right. So somebody needs to express their love or it needs to be balanced. For the month of February, let's see. We have separation. The time apart from your partner is on the horizon. Okay. And let your friends help you. So there might be um, something that's coming out with your friends that they might be helping you understand your separation or understand what's coming up on the horizon between how you strengthen into bonds and also somebody who needs to let the situation, let the universe take over, all right? I'm feeling like in March, for some of you um, Geminis, you got keep an open mind. Your soulmate may differ from your usual type and expectations, all right? Now, we also have reconciliation for the month of March. So beware, 
this person wants a reconciliation or there's something coming together returning to your life now for april there's a honeymoon coming honeymoon and a heart-to-heart -heart conversation so it could be like two different things here y'all could be on a, a vacation having a conversation some of you guys could be having a a heart-to-heart -heart conversation some of y'all could be taking vacations and enjoying your honeymoon okay but i'm getting for some of you guys it's time to really uh focus on what you want all right so let's get a soulmate card for my gemini's for the month of january the rest of january for my gemini oh okay and i oh that's too many here we go all right we got adventure awaits go find it uh oh so there's something new coming in you need to either go find it or find your center up in this bitch <laughs> For the month of February, we have sometimes the strongest people in the morning are the people who cried at night. So even when the shadow side comes around and the morning comes, the sun still comes out. All right. Here we go. For the month of March, we have the reason it hurts so much to separate is because our souls are connected. All right. So be aware of a separation, possibly. I'm also seeing for the month of April, everything you need, your courage, your strength, your compassion, and love, everything you need is already within you, Gemini. Talk to me, baby. Okay. So let's see if there's any other messages for my Geminis. <clears throat> Let me shuffle these cards. Any other messages for my Geminis from January to April 2020? Here we go, babies. Gemini, in the month of February, is there any messages Gemini needs to know about? We have the world, the Knight of Cups. And the two of pentacles. So there's a cycle that's continuing here at the bottom of the deck. I have the two of cups. Damn, that just slid on out. So there could be a union ship or something coming together, a romantic offer that's coming together, a cycle that's um, still continuing. I do feel like for some of you guys, there's a decision to be made about this connection and about this union ship in the month of February. Any other messages for Gemini? Six of Pentacles and the High Priestess. So I feel like somebody could be manipulating a situation with some money. Okay, something that you're already aware to or that you're going to be aware of with this King of Wands. Okay, I keep seeing there's possible Leo Sagittarius Aries. I do feel like when somebody gets some sort of money or something like that, I feel like somebody wants some relationship or a connection in a relationship. You got the Emperor energy here, right? So this could be someone who's wanting to control things, but I'm also getting that they're wanting to have control of you and your relationship. Um, I feel like this person is kind of um, a manipulator when it comes down to um, their way of being, of being, okay? So for the month of March, okay, we have the Chariot, the Seven of Cups, Ten of Pentacles. So I feel like you guys have a lot of options. There could be a lot of expansion and movement happening in the month of March. Gemini, okay. Some of y'all might be having a lot of choices coming in, but there's some wish fulfillment here. I do see a lot of cups, so try not to drink so much or, you know, just do it in moderation. But definitely a lot of expansion coming in for the month of April for Gemini. Any other messages? You got the Lovers, the Temperance. the empress so i'm getting um somebody wants to have you okay empress energy here you're being comfortable in your space but they're definitely coming back for a return i have the will of fortune here again so i feel like this is somebody who's definitely a soulmate you feel like you're um definitely connected from 
um, somewhere that is extraordinary. I do feel like for some of you guys with this, um, there could be some clarity coming out. But at the same time, you feel a little defeated because this person is very detached. But I feel like, like I said, justice is on your side, Gemini. So if you have done been done wrong, karma is here. Okay, if you have had any type of secrecy or you needed a break or something, karma's gonna give it to you. If you needed an extra boost, karma's gonna give it to you, okay? But I am getting in April. There could be um, somebody that's not really talking. They could be doing some like foolish behavior, okay? Something they're just kind of making actions towards. All right, could be some love action, so be aware of that. But I am getting that this person definitely feels like there could be a competition or there's somebody who's in the struggle, but they're still offering love here. So just be aware of people who are kind of wishy-washy and shit in love. Um, I am getting that someone's watching you. It could be someone who's very obsessed, a Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Okay, this could be in there, someone arising, also Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. But I'm getting with the Magician. Uh, for some of you Geminis, um, it's going to go into your favor, all right? But with this Ace of Pentacles, you guys got new beginnings coming in towards the end of April, my loves. There could be money opportunities, new money offers. You could be moving into a better place. But I'm seeing that you're uh, elevating to a better um, beginning. So... Give me an overall card for Gemini because you got the Ace of Pentacles, so definitely um, a new beginning, okay? If you think someone's lying, they are. Shit is going down with your job. And drop the fucking ego and get the fuck out of your head, okay? Believe exactly what you see, all right? And take the message for granted, all right? I love you, Gemini, oh so much. I'm going to get on out of here. If you need to get a personal reading from me, hit that description box down below. Joy and stability. Check out my website, laurelsmoon.com, for any other magical purposes and deviation workings and things of that nature. So I will see you guys in the next video. Peace.